Justin here again for Mystery Tackle Box. Today we're going to be looking at a topwater bait. Now, who doesn't like seeing a topwater strike? This is the Matsuo Sarasha. One of the things that makes it unique is it has tungsten components in it, so even though it's small, you can still get distance on it. And it has a small lip, so it's going to put out less of a spit than a traditional pop R. It's a little bit smaller profile, and it's a different look. Not many topwaters have flaring gills like this one. So let's check out some of, the, some of the gear that you need to throw this and some of the areas where this would be good to throw. So when is a good time to throw these small topwaters like this? I'm gonna say post spawn is amazing, but also right during the spawn, anytime the water is over that 65 degree mark, I'm gonna say you're in the clear to throw topwaters. Popping baits like this are especially effective during the spawn and right after the spawn. When we go into the summer, more of the walking baits tend to do better, they call more attention. But up in the shallows, when bass are around uh, vegetation, uh, around wood, and they're, they're, they're wanting a subtle presentation, like a weightless plastic um, or, or something to that effect, that's when these pop R's are very effective. I like to work these really slow in the early part of the year. So right during the spawn and right after the spawn, a twitch, pause, twitch, twitch, pause, pausing for four or five, maybe even more seconds than that. Really get that um, pause effect going. That tends to work on those uh, slower lethargic bass. And the water gets well into the 70s, they get more aggressive on top waters. But the popping and pausing just has a really good effect this time of year. So if you've got clear, calm, early morning, late evening conditions, or just overcast low light conditions in general, I'd say this is gonna be a fantastic lure to throw right up there in real shallow water where those bass are, and it's not gonna spook them, and they'll come up there and just, just grab it. It's not gonna be a big explosion usually in the, in the cooler months. They're just gonna come up there, and slurp it in, and then you might have a big one on the line. So that is the Sarasha Topwater. If you want to learn more about fishing baits like this, you can subscribe to the Mystery Tackle Box channel where you got videos coming at you all the time. And if you want to get baits like this sent to your doorstep, just go to mysterytacklebox.com, sign up for a plan that's right for you, and get them sent right to your door and get to fishing. We'll see you on the next video.